Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler in the booth, along with Kirk Herbstreet. Aaron Andrews is reporting from the sidelines. EA Sports and ESPN bring in tonight's exciting matchup between the Demon Deacons and the Duke Blue Devils. Wallace Wade Stadium in Durham, North Carolina. The landscape's as full of life as the crowd is for this game. It's a cold night, and what's worse, we've got rainfall. We'll see if it wreaks havoc on this game. And here come the Blue Devils. We're near the midpoint of the college football season, and these two teams are battling for position in the ACC. For Wake Forest, they've got a real bright spot at quarterback. He has a chance to light up the scoreboard playing against two corners who don't seem like top-flight competition. It's time for the coin toss, and it's a good opportunity to let you know that our game is brought to you by Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, the perfect combination of chocolate and peanut butter. Ross Duke lines return. up to kick this one off and we're just about set to get underway Ross from the six he gets out to about the 22 yard line the quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game The offense will start at the 22, first and 10. Carlson drops to throw, and he's hit before he can go anywhere. First and a foul, face mask on the defense. And the defense gives First up some down. free yards to the offense. Uh, you know, penalties can ruin a team's chances to win if they commit too many. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 41-yard line. Robinson takes a handoff. And they make the stop at the 49. Robinson gains around eight yards on the run. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. He's got it with room to run. Tackle at the 34. Well, I think this time he knew he was probably going to take a shot, but he hung in until the last moment and delivered a catchable ball. That's exactly what you want to see from your field general. It's first and ten. Ball on the 34-yard line. Peterson gets the call. Bounces off a would-be tackler. They'll get six yards. That brings up second and five. From the 28-yard line, second down. They'll run the option. Pitches, and he's got room. What a play, and that is first and goal. It's great when a running attack comes through for the first down like this. It makes an offense so much more versatile. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Let's see if their play calling changes now that they're in the red zone for the first time. 
And they got to him before he could get back to the line. The entire defense just collapsed on that run. He got penetration into the backfield. Nice job by the safety to clean up the mess. They'll bring him down around the eight-yard line. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. Good job by the junior linebacker to read the run and limit the play to a short game. Try this one from 28. No good. He hooked it left. No and the kicking team goes to the sideline very disappointed. When you miss a field goal at this short a range, you're giving away points. You're also giving a huge boost to the other team. And I don't know which one hurts more. They'll start at the 20-yard line. McLaurin takes a handoff. Got some open field. And they tackle him at the 45-yard line. And that carry puts him over the 1,000-yard mark for rushing this season. Just staying healthy an entire year should be considered success for a running back. But there is no doubt that this guy has been a large part of this team's success. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. McLaurin on the give. Oh, man, he took him down hard. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counter play. The blocking was great up front, and the tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. It's first and ten. Once again, a pickup of four on the play. That makes it second and six. It's second down, six yards to go. Nice run there. McLaurin picks up five with the carry. That'll bring up third and inches. Third down, less than a yard. Ball on the 33-yard line. And they'll run him again. Gets out to about the 31. So another run and another first down. It's time for the defense to buckle down. They need to start hitting the gaps and getting into the backfield. and avoiding a turnover. Second down and 17. Ball on the 38-yard line. Drops back to pass. It's a great job in coverage by this linebacker. He does a good job of reading the quarterback's eyes and is able to come up with the interception. From their own 25-yard line, first down.
Whoa, he just took a licking. Maybe a few, but that's it. That makes it second and eight. It's second down and eight. Ball on their own 27. There's a strike complete. He's down. That reception good for seven yards. That's a good completion. They didn't get the first down, but they picked up about seven yards. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. He's tackled at about the 35. And that's the end of the first quarter, and there's still no score. At the end of the first quarter, the score is tied at zero. First down, 10 yards to go. Carlson to the air on first down. Tackle made at the 43-yard line. Eight yards on the pickup. With the tackle at the 43-yard line. That makes it second and two. From their own 43-yard line, it's second down. Hit as he threw, and he completes it. And down he goes at the 44-yard line. That last pass got him only a yard. Nice grab there by the tailback to at least move the ball forward for some positive yards. seem to have an answer right now. They might need to change up some of their schemes. And this play is number eight on the drive. Option left. And he's stopped behind the line. Well, uh, these days, you've got safeties playing up close to the line of scrimmage, almost like a fourth linebacker. The only way that you can keep them from cheating up is to take some chances downfield. It's second down now, and 14 to go. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Carlson, options out. And they'll bring him down behind the line. Good discipline here by the defense, stringing the option out and plugging the running lanes. That moved him back. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 39. Carlson is looking to stay perfect on this drive. Anytime you can prevent a third down conversion, you're doing something right. Solid coverage. It's fourth down, and they're ready to punt this one away. Harris is back to receive. Didn't get all of that one. Quarterback couldn't maintain possession on their last drive. Let's see what he does here. Turnovers are so frustrating. I still don't think the last one was the quarterback's fault, but they need to avoid giving the ball away. Here's the run, got a hole. Makes it out to about the 39. Great job by the running back, and that's a gain of nine. That'll make it second and eight. McLaurin gets another handoff. Big opening down the sideline. The 10, and a huge touchdown play.
He splits the uprights with the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the drive summary. Wade gets set to kick this one away. From the eight yard line. Gets to about the 24 yard line. Let's see if this drive has a more rewarding conclusion than their last, which ended with a punt. They'll set up shop at the 24 yard line. First down, 10 to go. There's a flag on the field, and I think I have a good feeling of what this might be. Holding on the offense. Well, that penalty drives them back, and they're so shooting themselves down. in the foot here. Well, if they could just keep their concentration, they'll avoid situations like that. It's first down and a lot. Carlson drops back on first down. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. It's second down and a long way to go. Ball on the 14-yard line. And they make the stop at the 15. And the screen pass goes nowhere. That'll bring up third and one. Third down and a couple of miles here. Ball on the 15. Looking to throw. Doesn't get there. Great instinctive timing by the corner to deflect the pass. That's just really solid coverage skills. It's fourth down. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Harris will be the return man. Harris fields it at the 50, and he's taken down at the 45. They ran the ball very well on their last drive, and it resulted in six. We'll see if they can capitalize on the good field position. Duke is up a score. And he's taken down at about the 27 yard line. There was good pressure coming in, but he stood his ground and found his teammate for a nice game. From the 27 yard line, first down. Fires incomplete. He was looking for the tight end. Sure, it's disappointing, but this is the kind of mechanical flaw you can fix with practice and coaching. McLaurin, it's a handoff to the right, and they hit him in the backfield. The defense just met the blockers head on and drove them back straight into the runner. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 17. Back. 
Back to pass. Great concentration. He showed superb athletic ability on that catch. You know, the ball isn't going to hit you in the numbers every time. As a receiver, you've got to be able to adjust quickly and sometimes be willing to give up your body. There's a player injured, but it looks like it's just a stinger. The first time today, we'll get to see how this defense responds when they're backed up into the red zone. He may have changed things up here. Players in there, got it, touchdown. That was a well-drawn-up play for the wideout. And they saw something upstairs. It led to a touchdown. You can thank the play calling there. Very impressive. Let's send it down to Aaron Andrews with an update. Aaron? Thank you, Brad. When he came to the sidelines, his back was in tremendous pain and has not subsided. He might be able to get back in the game. Brad, back up to you guys. Hopefully he's back on the field soon. Thanks for that report, Aaron. Davis Looks like they're there. ready for the kick. Davis takes from the 10. He gets out to about the 25-yard line. Their last drive resulted in a punt, so let's see if they can put together something a little more promising here. From their own 25-yard line, first down. Finds the junior. He's tackled at the 27-yard line. They go to the air and pick up a couple. This junior wide receiver had absolutely no room to run after the catch. Good play by the defense. Carlson drops back to pass. Complete. And down he goes at the 30. Three yards there on the play. Usually you get a linebacker covering the tight end. So they might want to try some longer passes to exploit that mismatch. From their own 30-yard line, it's third down. Don't go anywhere, folks. It looks like we might have a pretty good game on our hands after all. Our score here at Wallace Wade Stadium, the Blue Devils, 14, the Demon Deacons, nothing. Smith. Second half just about set to get underway as the teams line up for the kick. Taken from the 10. And he shoved out of bounds at the 32-yard line. Now this offense has found the end zone on their last two drives. And they're coming out on this one trying to do much of the same. They'll go to work at the 32. First down, 10 to go. Denman drops back. Tries to thread the needle, and it's not going to work. Gets past the tackler. He's tackled at about the 49. That was a dangerous pass. Well, you should have known better than to throw that football into coverage like that. You can't expect the receiver to come down with that ball. This sophomore corner's got a ton of potential at that position. These coaches are really excited about what he'll do for the program over the next few years. He got hit hard. The quarterback didn't see anybody open downfield, so he took it himself and picked up some decent yardage. Second down, seven yards to go. Ball on the 45. He may 
takes it to the 45-yard line. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 39. So it's fourth down, and they're ready to punt this one away. Weiss can pin him deep in their own territory with a good punt here. The offense comes out to start this drive, and they're hoping for a better result as they threw a pick on their last possession. I look for the offense to come out with the same game plan as before. You don't make changes after one play. First down, Graham. And they bring him down at the 47. And that play could have gone for six. Oh, boy, you're right. And all week long, this secondary did a lot of talking about how they were going to dominate these receivers. I think this is time that they step up and prove it on the field. Forget about talking trash. Let's see how they react after giving up that big play. It's first and ten. And he's tackled around the 45-yard line. You can tell he's got a lot of faith in his wide receivers. Even when he's a little bit off target, they can pull it in and make something happen. Here's a counter to the right. Sheds that one. He takes it right side for a good game. The halfback goes forward for about five yards there, and that gets him the first. A little bit of over-pursuit by the defense gave him the room he needed to get the first. From the 40-yard line, it's first down. Run the middle and nothing there. McLaurin comes away with two yards on the carry. Woo! I think everybody in the stadium felt that hit. He really laid some lumber there. McLaurin gets the call again. He's knocked out of bounds at the 24. They've obviously found a formula for moving the ball against this defense. Let's see if any adjustments are made before their backs are really against the wall. It's first and ten. Ball on the 24-yard line. They bring the quarterback down. Great play by the defense. Ooh, but that time they came with the blitz and the linebacker was able to get free and come away with the sack. Second and long coming up here. Ball on the 30-yard line. Denman calls an audible. They get to the quarterback, and now the ball is loose. And they're lucky to retain possession of the ball there. Bad luck for the defense. They could have used a break there.
So the sack makes this third and very long. He's going to try and scramble. Throws incomplete, intended for his wideouts. Henderson was the intended receiver on the play. That makes it fourth and long. It's fourth down. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Wade is back to punt. He'll try to keep this one out of the end zone. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. Their last drive ended in a punt, so this quarterback's going to be looking for something better on this drive. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. He looks to throw on first down. To the 20. The 18-yard line. First foul. Gotta be careful to avoid these. Penalties are a great way to stall out a drive. Duke is about to extend the lead to three scores. McLaurin runs a counter. He breaks it. And he's shoved out of bounds around the four-yard line. Second down. So they line up on the three-yard line going in. They're crowding the line. McLaurin again. Touchdown, Duke! Tacks on the extra point. Let's take a glance at the drive summary. Davis Looks like they're ready for the kick. Davis fields it at the seven. There's, There's a flag on the play. Holding on the receiver's team. That penalty drives them back, and they're shooting themselves in the foot here. Well, if they could just keep their concentration, they'll avoid situations like that. They'll go to work at the 10-yard line. He's got it with room to run. And he's brought down at the 41. Perfect time for the play-action pass. Well, here the defense is looking for the run, and the play-action put him in even a worse position. They just weren't ready for the pass there. It's first down and 10 now after picking up some great yardage through the air. They'll go Brown. Brought down at the 43-yard line. They'll get two on that one. Two yards. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight. Ball on their own 43. Give it off here. And he's tackled Robinson after positive yardage. Robinson yards. picks up about four That'll yards on the misdirection yards. handoff. So we've reached the end of the third quarter in this defensive battle. Our score is Duke 21, Wake Forest nothing. Yeah. 
Third down, four yards to go. Ball on their own 47. Hand off and he won't make it. They'll be short of the first down after that unsuccessful running play. Nice job here by the defense on holding firm and forcing a fourth down. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. Here comes the screen, and they can't connect. I think they had to go for it given the circumstances. They just couldn't pull it off. A conversion there could have really helped them, but it just wasn't to be. They're on the right side of the 50 as they start this drive. Run the middle and nothing there. McLaurin picks up two yards with a carry. If it's any consolation, he did pick up some positive yards, but I doubt that's enough to make him forget the hit that he just took. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 46-yard line. Throws it in a hurry. And they tackle him at the 21. When you give up too many passes like that, and the game will be done before you know it. They cannot let these receivers get behind them. From the 21 yard line, it's first down. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Gets out to around the 12. Nine yard pickup. What sprung this play was some pretty good blocking up front. They read the blitz and picked it up nicely. It's second down, two to go. Ball on the 12-yard line. Another trip to the red zone. Last time, it resulted in a touchdown. And he's sacked. And for Lucas, he's tallied a new school record for sacks in a game. Now he's really forced them to change their offensive schemes with how disruptive he's been. That's influencing a game. Third down and seven. Ball on the 18. Takes it and he's tackled short. That play was over before it got started. That was just a case of the offensive line getting beat at the snap of the ball. It's fourth down, and the field goal team is out to try this 38-yarder. to kick this one off. Ross fields it at the 11, and he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field.
The offense will take over at the 24. Carlson on first down. He wants it all going long. It's broken up. It took a great play to make sure that long pass wasn't completed. Brad, the quarterback had his man, and lo and behold, here comes the defender, and the play's over. It's second and ten. Ball on the 24-yard line. Looks to pass. Oh, and he had some steam on that throw. And he's tackled at the 43. That makes it first and ten. Carlson to the air on first down. This one will fall incomplete. That could have been a huge shift in momentum if they were able to hold on to that one. Wow, that was close. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 43. Brought down to the open field. Seven yards there. Drops back to pass. Man, did he take a hit. It looked like they caught the quarterback by surprise. That's a great call by the defensive coordinator. They send him off the corner, and he just uses his speed to get the sack. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. He's looking to pass. Oh, he got nailed on that one. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Drops to throw, no protection. They got in there in a hurry. And they'll go with a no huddle. Carlson, back to throw. They hook up over the middle. He's taken down at the 23. Let's see how the defense handles the no hunter. Carlson steps back to pass. Incomplete. It's knocked down by the defense. Great play in the end zone by the quarterback. Man, oh man, this guy is some kind of athlete. He's a real playmaker out there on D. It's second and ten. Ball on the 23. He's pushed out of bounds at the 15-yard line. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. They look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. Third and two coming up here. And this is the 11th play of the current drive. This offense has really stalled on their last two trips to the red zone. Throws and it's incomplete. He overthrew the intended receiver. Oh boy, they take a shot here at the end zone and he just let that one get away from him. It's fourth down and the offense is getting set to go for it. He's gonna be short. And that was a big stop defensively. Yeah, they only needed a few yards here to keep the drive alive. Great job by the defense to shut it down. You really can't say enough about this defense. Fourth and short, and they really showed up on that play. McLaurin takes a handoff. Nice run there. The tailback picks up six there on the misdirection. That'll bring up second and three. And they go with a counter, and he's hitting the backfield. Personal foul, face mask, some of the defense. 
Concentration lapse right there. First the coaches down. will be giving them an earful for it, too. First and ten. Ball on their own 35. Down. Well, Brad, that is a great play by the quarterback to find his target past the marker to keep this drive moving. Way to look it in. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. There's a player shaking up on the play. to the line at first down. This passing game can be very effective if you don't get enough pressure on the quarterback. They use their personnel well and can be very tough to defend. From the 10-yard line, it's first down. The defense looks confident as they held them to a field goal on their last red zone trip. Fires incomplete, knocked away. He showed you some of his natural athletic ability following the play and making a really quick stab to knock away the pass. Second down. Defense gets set to defend the short field. today. He splits the uprights with the extra point. But here's the drive summary to recap what just happened. They're lined up to kick, and they might just kick it short and prevent a long return. Davis takes it at the 8. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. It's first and 10. Ball on the 27. He looks to throw on first down. That's incomplete. He had to get rid of that one in a hurry. The defensive coordinator cooked up a good blitz package that time, and although it didn't result in a sack, it forced a bad throw. Looks like an option here. The offense calls a timeout. From their own 24-yard line. Third down. Carlson drops back. The defender had it and then dropped it. And that should do it. Our final tally in this one. Duke, 31. Wake Forest, nothing.